Did you know there's a feature in Microsoft PowerPoint allowing you to rehearse your PowerPoint presentation, get feedback on your PowerPoint presentation before you actually deliver your PowerPoint presentation? Well, before I continue, please like, subscribe and share. So I've got a PowerPoint presentation opened up here with five slides in total. Now this PowerPoint presentation I've opened up in Microsoft PowerPoint 365, the web browser version. Now there is a feature called Rehearse with Coach, which allows you to rehearse your PowerPoint presentation, get feedback on your um, delivery before you actually deliver your PowerPoint presentation to your audience. And this is the way you access this feature. So at the top in the ribbon, um, obviously before that, open up the PowerPoint presentation you wanna deliver, which is here. At the top, click on home in the tab, scroll to the right side there, and you will see a present icon appear. On the right of it, you've got a down arrow. Click on the down arrow there. And then you'll have three options. Play from beginning, rehearse with coach, or present live. The one we're going to focus on for this video is rehearse with coach. So click on rehearse with coach. Once you click on rehearse with coach, it will take you to the actual um, rehearsal for your PowerPoint presentation. In slideshow mode, I've got my mic ready. The only thing I haven't got uh, which the app won't detect is a camera. So because what the Rehearse for Coach also does, it detects how you are speaking, but also if you are looking at your PowerPoint presentation, if you're looking away, um, if you're blinking a lot, those sort of facial expressions, it will pick up and give you feedback on that. It's a nifty little feature. It's brilliant. So on the bottom right hand corner, you will get a little welcome box appear. So welcome to PowerPoint presenter coach preview. As you rehearse, we will give you feedback about how you're presenting. At the end, you'll see a numerical summary and our suggestions. Let's go. So once we're happy, let's start rehearsing. So now the pop-up box suggests I can start rehearsing. So um, welcome to RA Solutions. This is my PowerPoint presentation. So um, this is slide two. Um, I'm going to talk a bit quietly now and I'm going to say um, 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 quite a lot of times. And there you go. It's picked up that and it's suggested for me not to use um quite a few times in this um, rehearsal. So um, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Uh, the quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. There you go. Try to avoid reading the slide, summarize your key points. So there are four bullet points on this PowerPoint presentation to show you. So again, this is slide three. Let me repeat what it's saying. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. The quick brown fox jumps over. There you go. Look, at the originality part here, bottom right hand corner. Try to avoid reading the slide. So I've got to make something up here. So this PowerPoint presentation or this slide has five bullet points. On to slide four. Um, nothing much to say here um, 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 there you go it's picked up um quite a few times there so it's telling me not to say um a lot and um, last slide so on and so forth so once you're happy with your rehearsal you want to get some feedback so um, you can either click on this mic here to pause your session there you go I've done um again or simply click on escape and now what it's done um, it's given me a preview, a report, my rehearsal, rehearsal report. So um, it's telling me to keep rehearsing, fair enough, um, to try and stop using filler words like um. And um, obviously, I think about the repetitive language, inclusiveness, and it suggests lots of different things. So, you, I, you know, I, what I would do is really check this um, rehearse with coach out it's telling me about my pace pace over time um, here it's talking about my pitch and um, originality it's picked up I'm reading um, lots of words here look slide two and slide three here um, so those two slides I was um, simply reading from the PowerPoint presentation which is quite true I was 
Um, so this, what it does, it allows you to build your confidence. Um, it allows you to iron out any issues with what you're saying before you actually deliver a PowerPoint presentation in front of a live audience. Um, if you haven't used this before, I strongly suggest you do so. Um, yeah, so check it out and please like, subscribe and share.